Hello, welcome back in my channel, Andy is United YouTube channel. Today, we're gonna talk about my experience meet when I meet one of the Manchester United legends, and it's a uh, Yep Stam. I believe everyone know who is Yep Stam, right? Is he is one of the best defender that Manchester United have, and is from Netherlands or Holland. So I have a chance to meet uh, Yep Stam in 2014 when Ajax Amsterdam comes to my country Indonesia. At that time. Uh, Yepstam is one of the official of the Ajax Amsterdam. Uh, so when Ajax came to Indonesia in 2014, uh, they come with the squad, uh, not the first team squad, because most of the First team squad at that time is preparing for the World Cup 2014. So they only bring uh, just a few players that uh, didn't uh, play at World Cup, and they they also come with uh, Yepstam and Fandusal because. Both of the both of them are part of the Ajax Amsterdam official. Right now, uh, Van der Sar is still on the Ajax Amsterdam, but uh, Yapstam is not is not uh, part of the uh, Ajax Amsterdam management or official right now. So, uh, in 2014, uh, when Ajax Amsterdam come to Indonesia, I go to the hotel with hope that I could meet uh, Van der Sar and Yepstam and also the Frank the Bull because uh, I love or I like Frank the Bull since uh, 90 because when I was grow up uh, I watched uh, the Ajax Amsterdam is uh, one of the best team in Europe at the time with the squad it's very uh, popular in Indonesia there's a uh, at that time Patrick Clifford, there also uh, Edgar Davids, Mark Overmars, uh, and then there's a uh, Danny Blind, Frank the Bull, Ronald the Bull, Christian Sedov, many Winston Bogarde, many many of the best player in Europe play in I asked them in mid nineties. So, uh, when I know that uh, Yepstam coming to Indonesia, I am very happy because this is the opportunity or this is the chance for me to meet one of the Man United legends. He's a good player and we know that uh, he have uh, good skills and no compromise to the enemy players that come to the defense area of Man United when they play as Man United players so I'm back for the story to the story uh, when Jeb Stam came to Indonesia I meet him third time the first time I meet him is it was on the it was in the lobby of the hotel. I remember that. Uh, at the first time, 
or the first chance I cannot take the photograph even uh, I only I only have opportunity to to have his uh, signature on the photo that I give to him because uh, I think uh, at that time uh, he he has a bad mood so he so he he's kind of like a uh, not friendly to the fans I don't know why because maybe he has he was on the bad mood at that time so he he looks like not unfriendly to the fans I hope it's not his character because uh, I uh, because uh, it should be uh, nice to the fans I know but at that time he looks unfriendly at the first time I meet him when pe when people or fans ask him to send the autograph uh, he refuse uh, sometimes he Sometimes he accept to he agree to sign the jersey or shirts, but uh, he looks unfriendly. I don't know why. That's the first time I meet him at the time. And then uh, even my friends, one of my friends, uh, Luis Utama, his name is Luis Utama, my friend. He said that. Uh, I don't know why uh, Yap Stam is so unfriendly. Maybe he he didn't like uh, visiting Indonesia or what, or maybe uh, his grandfather or his uh, family uh, involved in uh, war against Indonesian Indonesian when our independence declared in. 1945 so maybe he has a uh, uh, he has a defense or the, I don't know but that's uh, that's the what the, that's what's happened at that time Yapstam is not friendly at that time okay and the the second the second time I meet him when he when I come to uh, Indonesia in 2014 it was in the mid and good season so I entered the quiz held by Adidas Indonesia and I won and the prize is mid and good with uh, Ayak Amsterdam players but uh, at the at that mid and good they also Edwin van der Sar and Jop Stam at, at first I didn't know that uh, both, both players will attend the mid and get too but when I know that Yap Stam and Van Dessa also join the mid and get wow it's like wow maybe this is the chance for me to to meet and take autograph with Yap Stam and it's true uh, the Yap Stam is totally different uh, at mid and get because he's very friendly to the fans I don't know why he's very friendly nice uh, I also have uh, some a few a few autographs from him he even a uh, joke uh, sorry uh, if Edwin van der Sa even uh, made a joke that he he take my photo yep stamp photo and then she he give to the Yap Stam and said, and said look it this is you when you have more stats uh, when you play in Holland national team I remember that uh, even the Ayak uh, media also recorded with camera that moment uh, so uh, at the second uh, time I meet Jepstam, it was in the mid and grid and he was totally different from the first time he was so friendly and he is also kindly to sign all the 
stuff that fans bring to to sign by him. That's that's the, my second time meet Yap Sam. Okay, and the last time I met Yap Sam, it was uh, one day after the meet and greet. I go to the hotel. At the time, it's uh, match the match uh, uh, Ayak versus uh, Persija. If I'm not wrong, Persija Jakarta, one of the Indonesian football team. After the match, uh, I remember I go to the hotel and hoping that I can take uh, or complete the signature of Ayak Amsterdam players. When I'm waiting the Ayak Amsterdam players, uh, when they go to the special room that they use for the dining room, uh, suddenly Yapstam is walk, and then so I so I go to Yapstam and as photo and autograph, and guess what? He back. Uh, he speak. He become not friendly again. And I remember what he said. He said that when I give him a photo of him, that the photo is when he lift the trophy of Premier League. You know what he said? He said, "You want me to sign this? I know you will sell this in the eBay, right? Can you imagine?" Yep, some say that to me. He said that I will. He said that I'm gonna sell the photo in the eBay. Can you believe it? I don't know. Maybe he's in the bad mood again. So he, he said that. Hopefully uh, he's not like that because uh, I read. I I was sorry. I watched a video in YouTube. When Yapstam get interview by the media and he's so kindly and friendly. I don't know. Maybe when he visit Indonesia at that time, he is not in bad, in good mood. So he 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 emotion maybe is not uh, good at the time. That's why uh, maybe uh, he act like that, but. Hopefully, he's a nice person and uh, good to everyone. I hope I hope like that. Uh, meeting Yapstam is for me is a experience, a unique experience because uh, Yapstam is also my one of the, my favorite Man United players, and I know uh, it's very hard. Uh, to to meet Yep Stam in Indonesia again because maybe he is very is uh is there's no many chance uh, for Yep Stam to visit Indonesia except he come as the official or play at uh, Man United Legends maybe match in, in Indonesia. That's why uh, when I meet him in 2014, I'm very grateful. And I always admire him as a, a great defender player. And he's very tough. Even in the uh, Legends match between Manchester United Legends versus uh Bayern Munich legends a few times ago he, he is uh, he looks very strong even he was retired a few years ago okay that is that it's my experience with uh Yep Stamp in 2014 uh, I hope you enjoy my story I will tell all the story about my experience uh, related with Man United and don't forget to leave a comment click like and share this video to your friends family 
for everyone who love Man United. Thank you for watching the video and as usually, glory glory Man United.